For over 20 years, Project Fine has been helping immigrants integrate into the Winona County community. On March 12th, Project Fine will be holding an event that will celebrate what our new neighbors bring to our community. This next Tuesday, um, March 12th, there's a, a capstone event for our Cultural Arts and Ancestry program. Um, it's going to be held at Winona State University, uh, Crisco Commons, downstairs at the Student Activity Center. And it'll be uh, from 5 p.m. until 7 p.m. This uh, program is um, designed to build um, integration between cultures. We kind of are like a bridge. Usually we are on the other side, you know, as presenters to refugee and immigrants. This way we had them teaching us their skin, skills and talents that they're bringing with them. Now for a year they have been making different uh, objects and different arts and they are willing and happy to share with the entire community. Project Fine received uh, funding from the uh, Southern Minnesota Arts Council, which assists Project Fine in, uh, you know, we're able to utilize the arts to help get the word out with uh, our outreach and diversity, um, which has been a, a wonderful thing that we've been able to utilize for quite some time. Programs that we're able to use to, uh, to uh, share with the community, um, share amongst people of different cultures, along with you know, uh, the regular community of Winona. Um, very educational, very uh, wonderful experience, and it's, it's been a, a, a beneficial thing for Project Fine. Uh, we have five different groups that did um, uh, educational sessions on their background and their out, uh, uh, art and culture, uh, but we will actually have six because we had um, community volunteers from Winona that wanted to do some extra work for Project Fine to raise money and they did sewing. We will have a people from our community that did some sewing for us, which means we will have six different uh, art groups. Um, knitting, metal work, um, man clad story, uh, Native American and um, Mexican tiles. Event is free and we really hope that everybody will come on March 12th to um, see the pieces and also maybe to purchase something because there are great, great uh, things that will, were developed with love and joy. But most of all, this program really brings bridges between cultures. We have people from different cultures working together, talking, sharing about their background, but also through the art, learning about each other, as well as receiving community. Um, very well attended program. We hope we will continue, but with this capstone event, we really want entire Winona to come and visit and enjoy some good um, art as well as program. We will have among dancers that will be pre performing at 6 o'clock and we really hope that a lot of people will come. Also, we will have a children activities on that event um, that we will be sharing with uh, visitors and um, we hope to see everyone there. Now, as part of Tuesday's event, Winona Mayor Mark Peterson will be presented with a special quilt. She said that according to uh, 2010 census data, Hmong comprise the highest number of immigrants in the city of Winona. Mexicans are the largest immigrant population throughout Winona County.